Hi students, welcome to the session on aperture efficiency. This is one of the important parameters of the antenna. Let us see this parameter. So aperture efficiency is defined as AE is the ratio of uh, effective radiating area of effective uh, radiating area of the aperture to the uh, effective radiating area of the aperture to the what do you call um, effective radiating area of the aperture to the physical area of the aperture physical area of the aperture that's what uh, the aperture efficiency fine okay right so what we learn from this uh, parameter it indicates uh, what percentage of uh, it indicates what percentage of power incident upon the antenna incident upon the antenna is available at the feed point okay so that's what very important about this uh, parameter we know aperture effective aperture is a receiving antenna parameter right so when antenna is receiving uh, energy or power right that must be sent to the load right so let us assume uh, uh, 30 watts of power uh, a wave with 30 watts of power is incident on the antenna if uh, out of that uh, 20 watts is available right so 20 by 30 will indicate uh, aperture efficiency fine so it indicates how much of power incident upon the antenna is available at the feed point right so for example let us see this is our receiving antenna right the waves are incident upon it uh, with uh, 20 or 10 watts of power for example right out of that only 8 watt 8 watts are available at the feed point so this is the feed point so 8 by 10 that is 80 percentage is the aperture efficiency right so it is nothing but uh, Aperture efficiency is the effective radiating area of the aperture to the physical area of the aperture. But it is just for understanding I am giving this, but we detail on this. Let us see this now. Okay. So let us consider this uh, receiving antenna Rx. Fine. So this is our receiving antenna. Right. So here we have a transmitting antenna. Right. This antenna radiates and uh, let us see that they are all far away from each other. So at a distance of R, right? Depending upon the transmission antennas, gain and a distance, right? So it will receive some uh, energy, right? When the antenna, this antenna radiates, this will be energy of this antenna, right? So how can we calculate that energy, right? The energy received is given by power energy density power uh, power density power per area then this is multiplied by effective aperture effective aperture is nothing but area right this will give the power received yes or no so power density multiplied by effective aperture area is nothing but our effective aperture because we know it is a area right imaginary area so this is what uh, this will radiate power flow per unit area is power density so out of that if you multiply the incoming power flow with our area what we get is power received by the this receiving antenna let us see this now in mathematical format we know effective aperture is given by lambda squared by 4 pi into g right this is what a g okay so what is our aperture efficiency aperture efficiency is uh, effective radiating area effective radiating area is nothing but our ae fine divided by 
physical area of the aperture a physical so a is lambda squared by 4 pi right into g a physical is 1 by a physical okay so lambda i can write as c by f so we can write g by 4 pi a physical i write as a phi c squared by lambda squared sorry c squared by f squared instead of uh, lambda squared i write as c squared by f squared this is what effective aperture right let us take one calculation what is that is okay for a 2 gigahertz wave uh, suppose let us assume that transmitter is sending a 2 gigahertz wave with the gain of the antenna is 20 db i told the aperture efficiency depends on the gain and the distance so you see 20 decibel gain transmission antenna with our antenna aperture effective aperture is 0.25 meter square right this is for receiving antenna it is ae effective aperture of receiving antenna fine these two are transmission antenna characters right so what is aperture efficiency aperture efficiency is given by gain is 20 db 20 db is nothing but 10 power 2 I convert into linear scale g 4 pi uh, physical aperture is what you call 0.25 meter squared so 0.25 c 3 into 10 power 8 f is 2 gigahertz 2 into 10 power 9 square so what is the aperture efficiency now aperture efficiency is 71 percentage so from this what we understand that means a transmission antenna send a hundred percentage of uh, power of the hundred percent hitting seventy one percentage of power hitting the 0.25 meter square antenna is available at feed point at feed point and the remaining 29 percentage is lost that is what aperture efficiency meant fine so for example let us assume this is our uh, okay where is the satellite antenna from satellite the channel is sending this much of power this is our DTH antenna, consider like that. And we can calculate, right? If our satellite antenna has uh, what you call as a center 2 gigahertz signal with a 20 dB gain, it has a gain of 20 dB. And uh, our uh, aperture area is 0.25 meter square. Then how much uh, power is available at the our uh, cable? It is only 71. For example, we know this is our dish antenna. From here, we are fed with uh, our coaxial cable. Here, we have a TV. Fine. Right? So, if our uh, satellite antenna is like this, here, what is the thing? It has a center wave of uh, 2 gigahertz and it has gain of 20 dB. The distance between this is that is thousand kilometer. So out of the incident power incident, only seventy one percentage is available here. Twenty nine percentage is wasted. This is what aperture efficiency meant. I hope you understand this concept. If you have any doubt, please ask me in comment section. I will clarify. Thank you.